Hey guys, welcome back. It's Isabel here and today we're going to be unboxing my wedding shoes together. If you watch my recent life update video, you know that I am getting married soon. And in that video, I talk a little bit about why I've been away from YouTube for the past few weeks. So if you haven't watched that life update video already, I'll leave a link to that video in the description section below. So if you feel like catching up with me a little bit, do head over there. But for those of you who already watched that video, let's move right along and unbox my two pairs of Jimmy Choo's that I got for my wedding. And I wanted to let you guys know early on in the video that this video has been kindly sponsored by Farfetch because they've really seriously upgraded their discount code. So I just couldn't wait to share the discount code with you guys. So Farfetch has made their discount code 15% for new and existing customers. Previously, the Farfetch discount codes have mainly been 10% off for new customers only, but they have seriously been so generous this time around. So I just could not wait to share that with you guys. So my discount code is Isabel15. I think it is amazing. Jimmy Choo's are included in the discount code. So 15% off a designer pair of shoes is amazing if you ask me. So let me tell you a little bit about Farfetch for those of you who may not be so familiar. I am sure most of you have shopped there before, but basically Farfetch is an online shopping platform that connects over 3,000 of the world's best brands, department stores and boutiques to customers all over the world. So wherever you are, are located in the world you get the shopping experience from all these amazing luxury boutiques all around the world and that is why the stock selection at Farfetch is unbeatable so as you will see soon in my video one of the pairs of Jimmy Choo shoes were just nowhere to be found within Australia I did actually go into the Jimmy Choo boutiques here in Sydney and all of the stores basically told me they can't get these but what do you know I go on to Farfetch and I could find my own size so yes stock selection is unparalleled not to mention shipping returns and exchanges are just so easy customs and duties are included in the price so there's no surprises upon arrival if you are ordering something from outside your own country Farfetch also has a really good loyalty program called access so depending on how much you shop from Farfetch each year you get different tiers of membership and you get different exclusive benefits as you move up the loyalty program levels and some of the benefits are extended time period for returns and exchanges, early access to sale, exclusive sales, and access to exclusive designers. So I absolutely love shopping on Farfetch. You guys know that I've been shopping on Farfetch for many years before I started this channel or started working with them. So I will leave a link to Farfetch and both pairs of shoes that I'm going to show you on this video in the description section below. So do check it out and don't forget to use my discount code to make it even more worth while shopping on Farfetch. Now let's get into the first pair of shoes. These were originally the ones that I've been hunting down for so long. So let me just show you the shoes first and then I can share a little bit about how I tracked this down and why I thought this was a worthwhile purchase. So we've got the Jimmy Choo care booklet and the dust bag. Let me unwrap them and show you properly. So to show you guys, the first pair is these beautiful sparkly Thyra heels. Oh my goodness, guys, aren't they just stunning? So you can see so many crystals. Every which corner of the shoes are basically encrusted in crystals. So that is my first pair. I mean, look at even those heels. Aren't they just so gorgeous? It makes me so happy just looking at how sparkly these crystals are. I actually asked a Jimmy Choo sales associate what crystals these were and uh, they told me that these are all Swarovski crystals, but I couldn't find the information on their website anywhere. So I'm not sure whether that is true, but I would believe so because they are just so super sparkly. And I just love how, you know, they use different sized crystals. So you can see some big ones, some small ones, and that really adds another dimension to these beautiful crystal shoes. So this is the pair that I had to hunt down. So I first saw these beautiful sparkly shoes on Tamara's shoe collection video. So I'm sure all of you know Tamara. She is a very successful fashion blogger. I do watch her videos because she does general fashion as well as luxury fashion. And I absolutely love her style. I can't be as stylish as her, but 
some of the items that she features on her videos if I feel like I can work them into my wardrobe I do get quite influenced by what she buys but basically I saw this first on her channel and I absolutely fell in love with it and I remember Tamara mentioned in her video that these will make for really nice wedding shoes and when I started looking for my wedding shoes I remembered that so I went into Jimmy Choo and they told me that they didn't have any stock of these shoes at all so I kind of forgot about them and bought the other pair and then I remembered that Farfetch has a great selection of Jimmy Choo's so I searched for these on Farfetch and what do you know they did have these shoes and I was just so happy to find them so this particular pair came all the way from the Jimmy Choo boutique in Austria how amazing is that so yes these shoes took about a week to get to me and I am just so glad that I was able to find them now these shoes are very pricey they are not the most expensive Jimmy Choo shoes but they are quite up there I saw some Jimmy Choo wedding shoes go up to six seven thousand Australian dollars so it's not like that but they are definitely more than your average you know designer shoe price but for a pair of wedding shoes I don't think they are unreasonable if you are someone who likes designer luxury brands because I also considered Roger Vivier crystal shoes in the silver color in the high heels and they are basically the same price as these but I thought these will be a lot more versatile so the reason I was okay to get these despite the very high price point is because I can wear them as my wedding shoes and I think these are going to be worn more as the reception and after party shoes but they are not that wedding -y. they are very beautiful pair of shoes but I know that I'll be able to wear them again in the future with many many dresses so that was the reason I was okay to go for these and I thought if I don't get them now I'm not gonna get them at this sort of a price point the only reason I could justify getting this pair was because it is still my wedding shoes so I have a bit of an excuse to spend a bit more on a pair of shoes than what I would normally spend but at the same time, I know that I'm gonna be able to wear these again and again. So the cost per wear will be quite good on these. Also, I do find these true to size. So I am a true Australian size seven or US size seven, and these are the European size 38, and they fit me really, really well. So they are my first pair. Now, the second pair I actually got from the Jimmy Choo Boutique here in Sydney in Queen Victoria building. But in hindsight, I kind of wish that I had been a little bit more patient and got these on Farfetch as well because I found the price to be lower on Farfetch because of conversion. And I think Jimmy Choo shoes may be a little bit cheaper in Europe plus the 15% discount code. That would have made these shoes at least 25-30% cheaper than what I paid for them. But you know what, I really loved them and the customer service was amazing, so no regrets there. But it did make me think maybe I should have been a bit more patient and, you know, waited to get them on Farfetch. But never mind, because these shoes I think are actually quite reasonably priced for a beautiful pair of shoes like these. So let's get into my second pair. Because I got these from the Jimmy Choo Boutique and I did mention to the lovely ladies that this is going to be my wedding shoes, they included some beautiful cards. So this one says, something old, something new, something borrowed and something blue for your shoes. I do in shoes, that is so cute. They also wrote me a little card congratulating me for the wedding. And that is the something blue, which is the blue dust bag. They apparently give these out for all their brides. And of course you still get all of the usual care booklet, the normal white dust bag. And these are so, so elegant and beautiful. Ta-da! These are called the Sakura Heels in the 100 millimeter heel height, which is the minimum I would go for my wedding shoes. I wouldn't go any shorter. And in this beautiful tool material over here with the beautiful Jimmy Choo pearls at the front. How wedding-y are these shoes? So I am planning on wearing these for my ceremony. I know it's a little bit over the top to have a pair of shoes for the ceremony and another party shoes for the reception and the after party. But guys, you know what? I am actually only wearing the one wedding dress, both for the ceremony and the reception. So I thought, you know what? Why not have two different pairs of shoes? So these are also true to size. They're in the size 38 as well. 
and these are actually very very comfortable to walk in i do actually find jimmy choo shoes in general very easy to walk in and very comfortable for you know the heel height so i already know that they're going to be okay for my wedding day for me to walk around and stand in all day and these sakura heels come in a lot of different versions a lot of different finishes and a lot of different heel heights as well i went for a style that is very bridal but while i was in the boutique i saw a lot of ladies trying on the crystal version that one is really stunning as well they also have one that's got pearls all over the front of the shoe that one was really pretty to look at as well so i did consider those but when i put my feet in them they made my feet look a little bit chunky because of all the extra volume that all the pearls added so my feet aren't the narrowest to begin with and i just didn't need my feet to look even wider so yeah these are the ones that i went with i just love the tool detail that will go perfectly with the veil not that you can really see these shoes very much while i am wearing the dress maybe you'll see peaks of it when i'm walking but i think these will photograph beautifully you know when i'm getting ready and yes i am so excited about these so there we have it these are the two pairs of Jimmy Choo's that I picked up for my wedding and as part of my sort of wedding content I also thought about talking about the categories that I really splurged on and why and the areas where I've really gone budget so I've actually ordered quite a few budget-friendly items that were really affordable from Etsy instead of getting the more expensive traditional or the more designer alternatives like I ordered my veil from Etsy and when it came I could not believe the quality for like 80 Australian dollars that I paid so I would totally recommend that to anyone so if you guys are interested in that stay tuned for that for a future video thank you again to Farfetch for collaborating with me on this video and for the amazing 15% discount code so I'll leave my discount code once more on screen which is Isabel 15 along with the terms and conditions I hope you enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already as always thank you so much for watching and spending some of your precious time with me today and I can't wait to see you again soon in my next video bye guys